So here is crappy audio from the camera. Okay, and then here's his actual audio from the microphone he had on and the audio device, the H4n. All right, so Maddie's hair is fine. Are we rolling? Yep. All right. So much better. So the idea again is to sync them together. Now, thankfully, Final Cut does have an option to do this built in. Just hold down the command key on your keyboard and click on both clips. Right click or dual finger click onto one of the clips that are selected and go to synchronize. And just like that, it will create a brand new clip which will be evaluated and then synchronized have a really strong jawline so and then we had to do the additional step of right clicking and going to open in timeline this is the audio from the microphone on board of the video camera the crappy audio and then this is the actual h4n good audio we want to keep and we have to go in and literally turn this down by dragging this line all the way down now this is great um, and it's just one video clip but imagine if you had uh, 15 interviews, for instance, or you had a multitude of clips that you had to do this to, every single one of them, synchronizing them individually, and then you had to open them up in the timeline and then turn down every single one of those audio clips from the video camera. Now that's just another tedious step, which turns into 15 tedious steps and just becomes very redundant. With DreamSync, all we have to do is drag the clips in, hit the sync button, and it'll automatically delete that audio clip from the camera so we don't have to worry about all the crappy audio in the background, which is just great. Thanks guys for watching. If you'd like to get a copy of DreamSync, go to dreamsyncapp.com so we can send it right on over to you absolutely free. Thanks a lot guys. I'm John Acosta and I hope to hear from you soon.